through the blood of Jesus. Hey, my I know this land that I'm in. Yes, we are blessed for their blood. In this world where we have Everything is pervert. Everything is wicked. Everything is evil. They know and they know. Kila kila bando kibweku. Kila kila bando peodoku. Kila kila bando kibinduani tu. Only your blood can cleanse us. No, ndakame ya Yesu ito na utubani. Only the work of the cross. No, we are warm of Kelan. And we are gathered here, Jesus. Not to come and eat a band of yes, because of the work of the cross. No, no, we are warm of Kelan. The work that you did for us. We are allowed not to take this upon the wheat. Father, as we listen to your word, now start to give the keys at the Toyaku. I pray that your word, the word can end the Toyaku, will bear fruits in our hearts. They will now see how they will go see. Lord, that you will speak to every one of us. That's the power of your word. In the name of the Lord Jesus. We love you, Father, and we praise your name. To in Jesus' name we pray. We, we may be seated to the moon. And we go direct to the word. Reading the truth. Uh, last time we 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 taught about worship. And uh, I'm praying that we have been putting that word into practice. You know one thing that that um, that kept on coming in uh, as I taught the word. Is the story of Mary and mother. And you see when mother went to Jesus, he was at the same place. And that's where Mary found him. But there was change when Mary came. Mother was in a theological, it was like a theological discussion as, as a reverend told us. But Mary, Mary moved the heart of Jesus. Today we will look at uh, the topic of prayer. It's a wide, wide topic. But I want to pray the word of God in a, in a simple way as the Lord will guide me. Psalms 45. Verse 1. Psalms 45, verse 1. Psalms 45, verse 1. My heart is inviting a good matter. I speak of the things which I have made touching the king. My tongue is the pen of a baby brother. Goya kwa ni yusuete na ikete kanja kundo kuseo. Ni mbunena maundu ala na museo, na museo visi monsumbe. Uime wakwa ni kiandiki tamu andiki mwai. My tongue is the pen of a red writer. Uime wakwa ni kiandiki tamu andiki mwai. I like how the kamba puts it. Mwandiki mwai. Hmm. And, and you see, uh, when we were in school, uh, there, there's this time of dictation, right? And you, you're number one. Yeah. You're taught to write boy. <laughs> and by then, you don't know how to write boy. So you begin with M. <laughs> but we are ready. 
with your pen. You see, uh, my profession icon is, is a teacher. And I can, I can see how he's getting the, the pen ready to write. Yes, very ready. And, and, and your tank is like that pen. Your tank is like that pen. It's ready to write. And my point number one is that you have the power to create what you want to be. You have the power. The power is in you. The power is in you. And you know, sometimes we are very careless with our words. Mimi tu ni mjinga. Mimi ni mjinga tu. Mimi sina pesa. Your building. And one thing that I want us to do this morning, I want you to take a, a page, a blank page like this. Yes. And now you see, your life is just like this paper. And everything you want to be, you write. You write. You will. You will. You will write that. You know, at you una 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 fanya iso kale swatch. You just write your word. Your word. You will write. Mimi si 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 fai una jitarao and as as you as you despise yourself you're you're creating your your, your life so I want us to take a plain paper and just write the what you want to to be in the future what do you want to be maybe you were told you will be a big person. And you shared it with people and they discouraged you. Ati wa unasema utakuwa daktari. Daktari wa umbo ama ni wa watu. And you were discouraged. Now I want you to write what you want to be. By the promises of God. I want to give us three promises that God has given us. There are three things that we'll always, uh, a man will always struggle with. Sin, poverty, sickness. Sin, sickness, poverty. Those are the things that you pass over. Uh, someone will keep on struggling. But the word of God tells us in 2 Corinthians 5.21 2 Corinthians 5.1 2 Corinthians 5.1 Corinthians 5.1 are you there? Hello, are you there? For he hath made him to be seen for us. Without no, you, no sin. That we might be made the righteousness of God in him. So he took our sin. The moment that we were born again, by faith, we believe that Jesus took our sin at the cross and he made us, he took the sins and he made us the righteousness of God. So by now, as you are seated there, you are the righteousness of God. Say, I am the righteousness of God. So, so uh, anytime there is something the Reverend was teaching during the week, 
and he was saying that we 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 do not we sin is not our lifestyle. Ondo Reverend Unedi wa kema nise katika tewa wiki kana na iki kiana kito tewe la yuito. Yes, and when when someone sins, uh, when someone uh, lives in sin, na kana ina mondo wewe kala da yuwa pe kana e. If that that one that person is not with uh, is not born again, mondo sunde ya wa e mosi ya kile. He will not have that uh, they start uh, what is it called the heart the the thought of i'm living in sin ataka tu atafanya tu atafanya dhambi leo kesho bila kushtuka but as who are born again the moment you sin you will have that that mind that will be telling you no you are not supposed to be there you it get the difference so you you come to that point now I'm, i want us to what what i'm trying to say is we come to that point of believing we come to the point of believing about the righteousness that was credited to us by Jesus. So from today, there is no that you are the righteousness of God through Christ Jesus. Point number two in our declaration, our plain paper, that I am rich through Jesus Christ. In that book of second Corinthians 8:9 For you know the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ that though he was rich yet for your sakes he became poor that ye through his poverty might be rich Nondo ni muoma na muoma wa mwia waitu Yesu Kristo kana ona kau aye mudui Apie kanja kuondo wenu nikana inyo kuondo kwa uja wake mutone kutwika adui say i am rich through christ asianya ni mudui ndeni wa kristo yesu you are rich in the heavenly riches we mudui mudui mai tune and also on, on this world na we mudui ndeni wa thayo praise the lord amen Praise the Lord. Amen. Are you getting me? When no one watch. Are you following me? Oh, it we man you are rich. We must be in the riches of God. They know I'm out the man guy and in this world. And they know and they pray that Allah we must be rich. We must be. You know, uh zamani unajua kila mtu ako na zamani yake. Kila mtu eo tena wale. Asa mimi niko na yangu. Unakana hadi zamani. Kwa una tayari ona tena wake. Uh, when when uh, we were born again in the village this these people who will be nende tetune kuna hawa ambao wanafanya declaration na kuamua na unaona ni kama wanaenda saa hiyo na inaenda vizuri and and when we reach to this verse they, they will say i am very rich the heavenly riches mimi staki hizi za huko duniani praise the lord ndio ndio kwenda ile hapo di maundo ile lakini ni kama gonde staki i will walk i don't want the car ndiye ndakaje no nita banyene mbele na mao that vigor eh na hizi na kizito kinge mweke mwina wote na modhi ma gonde you know you need those resources in the unit we speak and it we the more we are to prosper the kingdom you cannot assume the one guy when they when you need the, right now the, the, the technology is very high or you ma when they kwa ma when they ma inge the technology is very high na technology yeah, and now you 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 will you will tell me you want to walk from here to kiambere or I walk from here to here to preach the word you the next month praise the lord amen so we need the, the riches for the kingdom to prosper the kingdom yesterday was telling reverend that if if i get a million 
I know where I will put it. Not for myself, but for the kingdom. And the Lord knows that. The Lord knows that. Number three, uh, that we are healed. We are healed. In Isaiah 53, Isaiah 53, do you know where Isaiah is in the Bible? Isaiah 53 verse 5. But he was wounded for our transgressions. He was bruised for our iniquities. The chastisement of our peace was upon him. And with his stripes we are healed. Praise the I am on the way. Five, five. Number five. Five, not three. Is I like to tell me on the way? It's an item from a store. I can't. And then I want to only wear Pondo, Wama, get your maito. I wait to wear Pondo, Wama, go for maito. We see the law. On the one more we do, why you know I care. Now it too. We are healed. Look at this. It's past. It's past. And you see, uh, you can have a condition. And now you will, you will always say, Ela condition ya kwa upendo wa wasi aulo wa wa kwa kisukale mimi huwa ni mtu wa kisada you are healed nina diabetes how how can you say that the, how can you hold that sickness no to na to meseke ndo kitu ola mtu wa kwa mungu ke yenge mm ile kichwa changu ambacho uniuma kimenirudia tena praise the lord Amen. You were healed, but because we say it, we begin by saying you have the power to proclaim, to do what you want to be. You see, now you are building your life. You went there and akumba na yuwaku. Na moto yuwe mana. Oh, 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 Unaposema haya maneno kwamba ule kile kichwa changu ule ugonjwa wangu umenirudia mm. ni kwamba ugonjwa wako utajua ulishatengenezewa pahali pa kuishi ndani yako So if if the sickness you don't have to own that sickness Kenda no wewe ina hata wao msio wao tuike wao Every morning when you wake up kila wao kaki yokoni declare tanga declare for your life tanga, what you want to be praise the lord Declare it, praise the Lord. Declare that I am rich. Even if you don't have that fruit, declare that I am rich. You, you see, there is one thing that I have never accepted in my life. And it is saying, even when I don't have it, one thing that I have ever told myself Praise the Lord. Amen. Yes, I will leave that name in the name of Jesus. Amen. So you are healed. So when you, so when you wake up every morning, declare, declare for your life. I want us to go in the book of Proverbs 8, 8 7. 17, sorry. Proverbs 8, 17. I will read it. It says, I love that them that love me, and those that seek me early shall find me. Praise the Lord. Amen. And and uh, I, I know this 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 word, uh, Proverbs 8, talks about wisdom, Jesus Christ. And you see. Uh, he says, I love them that love me. And, and them that seek me early. Them that seek me early. We are talking about prayer. Them that seek me early. And many are the times when, when we wake up for other things. 
What is your number one thing when you wake up? When I feel it. Amen. Shuleni. Siku ambao baba mwana isikudu. Ama kujitarisha wende kazi. Na kwa ambao kama. Ama and ama kwenda WhatsApp. Eh? Kwa ambao vipo. Kwa si uone. Kwa si uone. When you wake up the first thing we start for. Mwa kako acha ambao utambie simu yako gele mbika ba. Eh, just to find out what happened for the last thing. Kwa nini lango nyeo kuikwata. My my bishop will always say. Na bishop wa kwa asia. Seek the Lord when people are asleep. Manda ngai lango not those wee hours. Those, those are the times to seek the Lord. You, you know, you don't have to, to tell it and, or to show it off. People don't have to know what you're doing. But you know what you're doing with the Lord. You know what you're doing with the Lord. You wake up in the morning and you build your, your life. You wake up. You, you get into that seat of Siko. When everything is silent. And you're there communing with the Lord. At three. Jesus Thousands of promises in the word of God that you can use to build what you want to be. When, when I was growing up, there are these people who, will, who, like, who like just insulting. And you, and you will hear women in Mujinga. I will say, I am not. Stupid. I will even confront them. I'm not stupid. Because I am not. But you see, the parents, when 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 you're, you're telling that kid, when you jinga, when dia, huh? you are the poor dia. When you say you need to go to school, you need to go to school. You need to go to school. You need to even you see that child, you should to build your child to what you want them to be. When you tell them negative things, they will be those things. Na utakuwa na shanga mtoto wangu nani alimuroga? Wewe mwenyewe, wewe mwenyewe ukajirokea. Bwana asifiwe. So build that child. Tell them positive words that you can make it. You can you can be a doctor. No, but when I see you, when I when I was growing up, that's what my dad used to to tell me. Ichnia, he used to call me Ichnia. Na sayo ni kofumwa. When I see you, ni kofladit. And he would call me doctor. Na ipeka na kitale. When I see you. Amen. And that's what helped me. Na unose ni wande. Praise the Lord. Amen. Uh, I usually say the first time to hear the word university. I am very sure I did pronounce it like that. And my dad told me, Usome kwa bibi uende university. I remember where we were at. So we were going in the market. And I'm like, what is that? That you are saying you, I couldn't pronounce it. Ni kashanga hapo mali dadi ametaja ni wapi ni kajari kuni tamke kama ye ni kashindo. And 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 he told me put more effort. I want you to make it to the university. You can you can make it for four hundred marks. Na na oto ni opata marks. You can you can go for university and all that. What? How many years? 
How can I make it? I'm in the village. But I prayed through it. I remember when I was in class eight, uh, I could go when we were waiting for for the preps. I could go at the far end when we are waiting for the lights to be lit and that, and I'm there praying. In the classroom, in the classroom. And, and I could do it loudly. I could, I could pray and worship. And my teacher, the teacher on YouTube will find me praying and worshiping. But I thank the Lord that he was born again. So he could just bypass. Amen. You, you build your life. You have the power to build your life. Now I want us to go to, to next point very quickly in its fervency. Fervency in prayer. Persistence. Persistence in prayer. We are talking about prayer. Persistence in prayer. I want us to look uh, to this person, this Elijah. Uh, this uh, The story of Elijah, first uh, Kings 18. Eh? And uh, first uh, Kings 18.43. 43 and let me begin 42 and see so Ahab went up to eat and to drink and Elijah went up to the top of Carmel and he cast himself down upon the earth and put his face between his knees and said to his servant go up now look toward the sea and he went up and looked and said, There is nothing. And he, he said, Go again seven times. And it came to pass at the seventh time, hallelujah, that he said, Behold, there arises a little cloud out of the sea, like a man's hand. And he said, Go up, say unto Ahab, Prepare thy chariot and get thee down, that the rain stop thee not. Praise the Lord. Amen. And read for me 44. 43. Uh, James 5.17 James 5.17 says Elias, Elias was a man subject and Elias is just uh, another name of Elijah was a man subject to like passions as we are and he prayed earnestly that it might not rain and it rained not on the earth by the space of three years and six months Right. Uh, uh, I just wanted to connect it um, so that we can go Araka, mm. but we see that um, James 5 tells us the story of Elijah and he says and he says that he was a man of like passion but he made a difference he made a difference. He prayed earnestly. He prayed fervently. Praise the Lord. Amen. Elijah prayed fervently. And, 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 and I like where we have read First Kings 18. Eh? It, it says that he put his head in, in his knees. Eh? Praise the Lord. Amen. Uh, the mamas will um, will uh, will bear me with this. That, but science tells me that the best position of, of uh, the best bathing position is the kneeling position. Uh, I don't know. 
but <laughs> but science has told me that 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 is the 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 kneeling position is the best bathing position. And you see, you can't you can't uh, put your your head on your knees if you you're not kneeling. Praise the Lord. And we see Elijah. We see Elijah in the bathing position. We see Elijah in the bathing position. And he goes to bath. He goes to bath. He says, I have to bath this way. I says, he says, I have to bath this way. Come, Lord, this way. Has to come. For the first time we praise when the, the head is on the knees, he is laboring. He is laboring. For the first time there is nothing. For the second time, I was looking at the 
I, I want to say, I want to give you the people. There are so many people in the Bible, but I just want to give you some people who, who, who stay with God. Now they were great, great people. Look at Jesus. Jesus will be with the crowd during the day, but and in the night he will be alone praying. You see the apostles in the upper room. The, the, the Bible says in Acts 176. Acts, Acts, Acts 17, the apostles turned the world upside down. Why did they turn the, 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 the world upside down? Because, because they had long time with God. They had long time with God. And I know you can't long time with God. And be small. David in the wilderness. David was a small boy. But he, he spent his time with God. And God raises him from the wilderness, from the place Atta Ajulikan. But he raised him. Why? Because of spending time with God. Moses. Moses. 40 days with God. Yeah. And it intrigues me that he wrote the words that God himself was supposed to write. And God brought him to the place of writing of writing what he was supposed to write, what God was supposed to write. Hallelujah. Get this, God brought him, he raised him. It's the same thing, the assign that Uhuru has to sign. You, you signing that sign. Because you spent time with him. No, 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 Praise the Lord. That's how God. God is more than Uru. And when you spend time with God, it makes you a big pastor, a great pastor. You, you, you can't spend time with God and don't be small. When, when, when you spend time with God, it takes the slack, the dirt. It takes the dirt from you. It takes every that. And you know, as I, I said, that this world, it's just full of evil. Full of evil. You get into online. 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 And the advertisements there. For every sake, why are you advertising this? Naked women, just it pops in your screen. It's just pops. You, you were, you were, you were looking for scripture. You were searching. You were doing some uh, online Bible study. And it pops. You're like, for God's sake. For God's sake. It's, it's full of, it's full of evil. 
But when you spend time with God, he makes you a new person. He makes you a great person. He makes you a new person. He makes you a great person. Let's be on us. On our heart. On our heart. Let's come. Let's go to the Lord and ask the Lord to give you the grace. To give you the grace to spend time with Him. To spend time with Him. That you will not only take five minutes with God. With God there is no speed. You have to wait. Elijah waited for seven times. He did not give up. And to have to wait with God. There is no speed. Kuri mashandelele bosanda la bosika ya la bashanda la makaya. We pray for the power of the Holy Spirit. The Spirit who prays with us with groanings that cannot be expressed. Kura bashande lele bosaka ya la bazanda la bosaya. Come Holy Spirit, come malese kala bosata la bakaya. Come Holy Spirit and teach us. Teach us how to pray. Shila makaya la bosa kanda la la bosia. Le katala bosa ya la makaya. Teach us how to pray. Holy Spirit, we pray. Eri mashande le le bosa kaya la bashanda la bakaya. You will praise in us with groanings that cannot be expressed. E kora bashanda la bakaya nde le bosa. E la bakata la bosa kaya nde le bosa. Eri mashanda la la bosa kaya nde le bosa. Le bosa kama nenda. Re bosa ya la bosa ya la bosa. Le kata la bosa kaya le bosa nda. Le makata la bosa nda la nda. Yes, Lord, come, Mashela Makaya la Bosaya la Makaya, El Surian Tayara Makaya la Makaya. Worship him, worship him, worship him. 